All right, we finally have ourselves content. We finally have content. I am excited. I'm hyped. Uh, but yeah, so I know I kind of late to this. I was out and about, but we are going to be having a maintenance tomorrow. It's going to be about six hours long. Um, and we are finally getting chapter 5 content, so we're going to be getting chapter 5, main story, affinity quest, all that stuff. We are going to be getting Key Auto as well as Kahono, so these two characters will be coming out, which is pretty cool. Um, also, we are getting the brand new SR as well, which is going to be like the old geezer, part of the chapter 5 story. So like if you guys remember, like he was one of the first characters that we were introduced to um, during chapter 5. So yeah, we're going to be getting him. He's going to be an SR character, which is pretty cool. I do like how like every update we are getting a brand new SR character and or rare, which I think is pretty, pretty cool. Because of the fact that like they just don't keep releasing SSRs as like also side characters, which can be very useful. So I'm a huge fan of that. Um, let's see. Also some brand new packages as well, which is going to be pretty cool. Brand new event, so if you do add your or link your account to something, I'm assuming it's going to be through the forum as well. We are getting 500 crystals, which is pretty nice. So a lot of games do this actually. Surprise wasn't here on day one, but nonetheless, I will take it. Uh, let's see, brand new event. Let's see, added conch shell event acquisition mission. Okay, so we kind of already known about this through leaks. And um, yeah, so I'll go through the whole mission event and everything once we actually get the event and content. Uh, these two are actually here. They were not supposed to be released, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, if you guys played yesterday, yeah, yeah. If you guys played yesterday, then you guys did see these two events. The Raid Golem is back, and then this thing is here. So yeah, pretty cool stuff. They are giving a good amount of reward stuff. But focus on the raids. This is like highly, highly essential. Um, and then this thing is pretty cool as well. So I'll go through these whenever, you know, the game is back up and running. Uh, let's see. These characters will no longer be here the banner wise at least so they will be added to the general pool um if you guys didn't summon on it by now then i guess just kind of wait off i feel like most of us are done with this banner anyways just because like we either got noel from a gateway of destiny or we summoned already but yeah don't chase these guys too too ham um at least in my opinion because if you got them ready then you're good you don't really need dupes on you know as well as gouch just noel for dupes but um yeah she's broken you already know that so let's see, um, they are changing, extending the season 2 content actually, which is pretty interesting. So I'm assuming that they they didn't plan on doing this, they, they extended it by like a couple of days, which is, it isn't anything too crazy, but yeah, we'll take it. So we have season 2 event, uh, Gateway of Destiny, and then the Hall of Illusion, Battle Pass, and stuff. But yeah, this one I'm very excited for because like I always tend to do these last. <laughs> I'm very bad about it, but um, yeah, just remember to do that as well, free crystals, free rewards. Um, let's see, limits to challenge re uh, reorganization, change, okay, so there's pr three per day, okay, also they're increasing this, I think, existing number of entries per day, three, change number of entries per day, ooh, clear rewards drastically increase, increase consumption action, I I'll take it, I will take it, wait, this is actually huge, so wait, are they actually upping this number of we can do? That would be super duper nice, actually. Uh, improves so the defeat is not counted in the number. Of Dude, this. Oh my god. I love this because of the fact that, like, there would be some events that, like, I would not be able to beat just because, like, it's, like, so stupid. And so it would actually count that in, like, the 50 runs I do. So I'm not sure how many times it actually completed out of 50 runs. Sometimes it would end up being, like, 40 or, like, 35 or something, but it still counts as 50 runs. So I wasn't entirely sure how many of those 50 runs were actually completed and I got rewards for. But yeah, I'll take that, dude. This is so huge. Um, okay, improve gouge to get the buff with the highest attack and magic power and magic power. That's huge. I'll take that. Um, Noel, I love it. I love it. Okay, so this is actually huge. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Okay, love it. Love it. Love it. Um, so they are actually buffing Nozel and Fugolion, which is interesting enough. I don't know how big of a buff it is, but yeah, I'll probably do a separate video for it to actually test it on C. Because I actually have these units, surprisingly enough, so I can actually test them out. But, um, yeah, we'll see how good they are if they're actually anything too crazy, but it seems like it's actually a decent percentage. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, nothing too crazy from what I'm reading here, and then these are just little bugs here and there but overall nothing too crazy when it comes to the update um i'm very excited for new consoles i feel like we definitely definitely need it chapter five i feel like it's gonna keep you know every single player the busiest the most just because you know you need story tickets and story tickets we have to wait for so 
Unfortunately, it's kind of just a waiting game again for this week and next week as well. Um, but don't expect anything too crazy when it comes to content wise. We just have these raids, which I think is very, very nice. It will keep us busy for the meanwhile. But um, yeah, overall, nothing too crazy. And then whenever we do get kits for Kyoto and Kahono and the old geezer, I will do my video for that. But for now, that is just content. That is just content for tomorrow's maintenance, six hour maintenance. I will try to go live if I can. Uh, fingers crossed. But if not, then um, yeah, I will see y'all with the content summons, all that stuff, whenever the game just, you know, go live and all that stuff, right? Yeah, I mean, y'all take care of a good one. Peace!